On December 7, 1941, at 7.55 a.m., the United States experienced a significant and surprising military attack when Japanese naval aircraft, launched in two waves from six aircraft carriers, targeted Pearl Harbor. This unexpected assault marked a pivotal moment in history, catching U.S. forces off guard. Although the attack cost only 29 Japanese planes, 2,400 U.S. sailors and soldiers died, and 1,200 were injured. One day later, on December 8, the Japanese launched the invasion of the Philippines, and the U.S. and Filipino armies eventually surrendered on May 8, 1942. One month earlier, on April 9, the Imperial Japanese Army in the Philippines began the forced march of 75,000 American and Filipino prisoners of war. This 65-mile-long transfer, characterized by severe physical abuse and arbitrary killings, would become known as the Bataan Death March and would claim over 18,000 lives. The name of the Japanese Lieutenant General, responsible for this war crime and who would become known as the Beast of Bataan, is Masaharu Homa. Masaharu Homa was born on November 27, 1887, in the city of Sato in Japan. In May 1907, Homa graduated from the 19th class of the Imperial Japanese Army Academy, and three years later from the 27th class of the Army Staff College. Masaharu Homa had a deep respect for the West and served as a military attaché in the United Kingdom for eight years. In 1918, he served in the British Expeditionary Forces sent to France and was decorated with the Military Cross. By the end of the war, he was already a father of two children, a son, Michio, and a daughter, Masahiko, whom he had with his first wife, Toshiko. Homa then returned to Japan but from 1930 to 1932, he was again sent as a military attaché to the United Kingdom. He was also assigned as part of the Japanese delegation to the Geneva Disarmament Conference in 1932 and served with the press section of the Army Ministry from 1932 to 1933. From 1933 to 1935, Homo was again given a field command, as commander of the Imperial Japanese Army's 1st Infantry Regiment and was promoted to command the Army's 32nd Infantry Brigade from 1935 to 1936. In 1937, he was appointed aide-de-camp to Prince Chichibu, who was a brother of Emperor Hirohito. With Chichibu, Homa made a diplomatic tour in Western Europe, attending the coronation of King George VI at Westminster Abbey in London, which took place on May 12, 1937. In July 1938, Homo was promoted to Lieutenant General. With the start of the Second Sino-Japanese War, Homo was appointed commander of the Army's 27th Division in China from 1938 to 1940 and directed the blockade of the foreign concessions in Tianjin, where he led the negotiations with the British. After the fall of Nanjing, Homa publicly declared that unless peace is achieved immediately, it will be disastrous. He was right. Up to 300,000 civilians and numerous disarmed Chinese soldiers were killed in Nanjing over the course of two months. The chaos, fires, and mass graves make an accurate casualty count impossible. On December 7, 1941, the Japanese attacked Pearl Harbor. One day later, they launched the invasion of the Philippines. The specific task of invading and occupying the Philippines was entrusted to the Japanese 14th Army, which consisted of more than 43,100 men and of which Homo was the commander. On January 7, 1942, the Battle of Bataan began, fought by the United States and the Philippine Commonwealth against Japan. Despite their lack of supplies, the American and Filipino forces managed to fight the Japanese for three months, initially engaging them in a fighting retreat southward. The American surrender at Bataan on April 9, 1942, was the largest in United States history, with 76,000 soldiers surrendering in the Philippines in total. The defeat marked the beginning of three and a half years of harsh treatment for the Allied survivors. After the battle, Homa and his staff encountered almost twice as many captives as their reports had estimated, creating an enormous logistical challenge of transporting and moving over 60,000 starved, sick, and weakened prisoners and more than 38,000 equally weakened civilian non-combatants who had been caught up in the battle. Eventually, more than 60,000 Filipinos and 15,000 American prisoners of war were forced into the Bataan Death March, which began on April 9, 1942. 
The Japanese did not provide medical care for the prisoners, so U.S. medical personnel tended to the sick and wounded with few or no supplies, and part of the death march took place on trains, in brutally hot and unventilated metal boxcars. At least 100 prisoners were crammed into each of the unventilated boxcars. The trains had no sanitation facilities, and disease continued to take a heavy toll on the prisoners. Among Allied soldiers, Homa became known as the Beast of Bataan. Reports from sources vary in death numbers from 5,000 to 18,000 Filipino deaths and 500 to 650 American deaths during the march. However, approximately 10,000 to 12,000 men eventually escaped from the march to form guerrilla units in the mountains, tying down the occupying Japanese. The total distance of the march from Marivelas to San Fernando and from Capas to Camp O'Donnell is reported by different sources as between 60 and 69.6 miles or 96.6 and 112.0 kilometers. The death march was later judged by an Allied military commission to be a Japanese war crime. In March 1942, MacArthur, his family, and his staff left nearby Corregidor Island and escaped to Australia, where MacArthur became Supreme Commander, Southwest Pacific Area. Upon his arrival, MacArthur gave a speech in which he promised I shall return to the Philippines. After more than two years of fighting, he fulfilled that promise. Japanese forces in the Philippines were ordered to surrender by Tokyo on August 15, 1945, after the dropping of atomic bombs on mainland Japan and the Soviet invasion of Manchuria. After Japan's surrender, in mid-September 1945, the American occupation authorities arrested Homa and extradited him to the Philippines, where he was tried in Manila by an American tribunal on 48 counts of violating international rules of war related to the atrocities committed by troops under his command during the Bataan Death March. During his defense, Homa claimed that he was so preoccupied with the plans for the assault on Corregidor that he had forgotten about the treatment of the prisoners, believing his officers were adequately handling the matter. He claimed he did not learn of the atrocity until after the war, although his headquarters were only 500 feet or 150 meters from the route of the march. Homa stated in court, I came to know for the first time in court of the atrocities, and I am ashamed of myself that these atrocities have happened. On February 11, 1946, Homa was convicted on all counts and sentenced to death. Originally, Masaharu Homa was to be hanged, but at the request of his second wife, Fuyiko, he was executed by a firing squad. Hama's wife visited Douglas MacArthur to urge a careful review of her husband's case, but MacArthur affirmed the tribunal's sentence. When Masaharu Homa was executed by a firing squad by American forces on April 3, 1946, in Los Banos, Philippines, he was 58 years old. General Douglas MacArthur wrote in his review of the case, if this defendant does not deserve his judicial fate, none in jurisdictional history ever did.